What's going on guys? Back at the range today with something cool for the P30L, something different. Here it is, the HK Parts Lighted Comp. All right, so you might have seen my video a little while back on the Langdon P30L with the movie correct, all but movie correct, uh, John Wick thread on commentator. Awesome gun, awesome piece, awesome way to set up your P30L. Now what I've done, taking that off, HK Parts has a brand new P30L comp and you got a flashlight built in. What I like about this is a lot of the other comps, you know, they come with the rail attachment. You can put something on, but what's really cool is that they've integrated this in here and it's actually pretty, pretty bright. Uh, I don't know what the lumens are off the top of my head, but everything is right there. The switch is easily actuated. Uh, it's built in. It locks through the pick rail with this little lug here. It goes through and then you screw it in to tighten it down. And it's got the little compensator. I like that. So the compensator got this, the standard barrel back in there because uh, it is not cut out for a threaded barrel. Uh, but never, nevertheless, it is cool. Now, what you also see here is I got the optic off, just running the iron sights, the raised iron sights that you get with Langdon's package for their optics ready setup. So I wanted to try something a little different here and just switch it up a little bit. Um, I can easily put it back on if I want to, but I wanted to kind of run it sleek for this with the light and see how it works. Uh, one thing, if you're not really up on this sort of setup, uh, the difference between the rail mounted compensator and the thread on compensator is you're not going to have to worry about uh, the spring weights and the issues that I had with the thread on version because it's so heavy and so big it messes with the spring weight you need to change that or it's not going to cycle reliably now with something just mounted to the pick rail you're not having any extra weight hanging on the barrel or the slide to make that an issue so if you don't want to go that crazy into it and be a movie correct gun and just want a little compensator want something that's cool uh, they make a variety of different comps for all the VP and P30 lines. So uh, it's pretty cool. Let's get to shooting, see how it feels. Feeling good. Felt pretty flat. We'll run it again. It feels, it's a different, it's a different vibe than the actual big comp on there. So. Obviously with the flashlight on there, it makes the whole thing a little heavier. So it feels different than what I was just used to shooting the comp for a while. So it probably didn't look too flat there. I'm gonna run it again real quick, it just... Yeah. Man, I flinched on that one. So yeah, I mean it feels good. It feels like it's, it's doing its job. You can see a little bit of gas coming out the top there. So it does feel like it's pushing it down a little bit. The extra weight there is doing its thing. Anything that HK Parts does, I mean, I've got a bunch of stuff for the VP9 overhaul. I'm sure you've seen, or if you're not seen, check those out. Did a whole video series on that. But this is cool, man. I like how they integrated the light. You don't have to worry about putting a light on and all that. You're still gonna have to get a custom holster made for this, unless they also come out with a holster specifically for it. But I just dig how it's built in. Very sleek. Silencer Co. Uh, gun with this built-in suppressor. I forget what the name of that is right now, but that's what it kind of reminds me of just looking at it. Uh, but now it feels good. Of course, Langdon doing their thing. Flat trigger. I like a flat trigger with a 90 degree break. And the reset on that. On the wall. I think that was a bad representation right there. Let's try it again. Wall. Guys, somebody's going to be like, oh, it's still a long trigger. A hammer gun is <laughs> a hammer gun. That's a very short reset for a hammer gun. Usually you got to bring them all the way out um, and then come all the way back. But this thing is great. If you're not checking out Langdon, check them out. They do a lot of great work for Brettas and HKs. Feels good. Feels flat. I dig it. I dig it. This is a Streamlight powered light. The Streamlight 
patented buttons and things and switches that they use. This is momentary and constant. And then strobe. Everything looks good. It's a pretty hot center, 1,000 lumens. There is some spill, as you can see, in this dark room, but more of a hot center. But guys, if you want to see more, you got to get subscribed, and you got to follow me on Instagram at SteveMP5. I'll see you next time.